Welcome back to Paradise TV here from Cape Harbor. We're in the promenade surrounded by shops and restaurants. And speaking of restaurants, how can we have a cool themed show without a double scoop of ice cream? <laughs> Paradise TV got the scoop on a local shop that has a long history here in Southwest Florida and I just know you're going to love their story. There is just something about Love Boat ice cream that everybody loves. Oh, I love it. I've been coming here for 10 years. The Love Boat. I'm getting on a plane in about two hours, and I had to have one more helping of banana walnut chunk <laughs> from the Love Boat. <laughs> what is it about Love Boat that's so different and so unique and that keeps people coming back? Well, I think we have a great group, group of kids here, a wonderful mm -hmm. group of kids, and uh, we think we have the best ice cream in Southwest Florida and we give a lot of it when mm -hmm. we serve it. Since 1965, Love Boat Ice Cream has been serving up cups, cones, and shakes to folks from around the country. Don't believe us? Just check out their guest books. I love how there's like ice cream on the pages. <laughs> oh yeah, there's some ice cream right there. But as you can see, we had on 41311, a great ice cream shop, Paul and Bonnie White, Kingsley, Michigan. And for many families, stopping in for a scoop is a downright tradition. Sometimes going back 40 years where let's go to the beach mm -hmm. and the kids say, let's stop at Love Boat on the way back. And that, uh, that has happened. And we, we've had uh, people come in and tell us that they've been engaged here or become engaged here. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. fun, fun place. A fun place with a fun name. The name is a lot of fun. Love Boat. Any connection to the Love Boat? Well, I was not around, when the, <laughs> when, but the, uh, the genesis, I guess, of the name, uh -huh. uh, a, a family called The Loves uh, started Love Boat. The rest, they say, is delicious history. What is your most popular flavor, Well, most requested? We go through vanilla more than really? anything, but because of shakes, because of okay. Sundays, but butter pecan, I think. Uh, really? I would have uh, thought chocolate. But before I truly recommend a scoop of Love Boat ice cream, I figured I should do what any trusted television host should do, a little hot fudge sundae taste test. Now, how many scoops? Um, four is in a small. Four is yeah. in a small? Our portions are really big. Really big, but oh so good. After some hot fudge, peanuts, whipped cream, and cherries, I too am totally in love. Uh, it makes me happy. All right, something else really cool about Love Boat ice cream is if you bring in a pennant, either a college team or a sports team, you get a free scoop of ice cream. Did you say free? Sign me up. Oh yeah. What are some of your favorite local restaurants and hangouts? Message us on Facebook or send us an email and maybe we'll see you in paradise. If you're looking to cool off with a weekend away, here in Florida, of course, you don't have to go too far. Oh no, SeaWorld Orlando is opening a brand new attraction. It's called Antarctica, Empire of the Penguin. It's a voyage to the bottom of the world. You'll be surrounded by the sights, sounds, and awesome encounters found in this frozen frontier, embarking on a one-of-a-kind ride and an incredible first-of-its-kind family ride. You'll even get to experience the mystery and wonder of life on the ice through the eyes of a penguin. Back here in Southwest Florida, you need to make sure and grab your swimsuits. There's lots of options to choose from for an afternoon escape from the sun. At Sunsplash Water Park in Cape Coral, your entire family will enjoy the 14 acres of water slides, pools, food, and fun at Southwest Florida's largest water park. Whether you prefer a relaxing ride down the lazy river or a slippery trip down the scream-worthy slide Cape Fear, this place is sure to help you beat the heat. And for you adrenaline junkies out there, you have to check out the Revolution Cable Park. This place is so cool. Out on a lake, surrounded by pristine wetlands and nature trails, you can wakeboard, kneeboard, ski, or wake skate, all without a boat. Believe it or not, it's all done with cables. The upward pull of the cable system allows you to do a lot of tricks that you can't behind the boat. We have all of these obstacles out here that opens up a whole other world of opportunity, different tricks you can do. Out here it's flat and you can pretty much go all day and you'll be sore, but it's a good sore, so 
And a big bonus for the environment, using the cable system infuses five tons of oxygen a year into the lake water, which helps the plants and fish and clarifies the water. It kind of reminds me of zip lining. Have you ever been? A little bit. No, not yet. Oh, you're missing out. All right. Well, up next on Paradise TV. Canoes and costumes. It's a wild and crazy afternoon in Naples. But first, here are some more upcoming events in Paradise.